when when things started to go wrong, you've been asked about this uh, already. Uh, you had a meeting with Jim McCall uh, in in the Parliament uh, in June 2018, um, and this is when CML and FML were, up, let's say, at loggerheads. Um, Jim McCall asks you to intervene, he says, uh, and instructs CMAL to take part in the expert determination process. Let's call that mediation. And according to him, you said you couldn't intervene. So is, that, is his recollection correct? So I, I, I again, I, I think I tried to answer this to Mr. Was Mr. Beatty, I think, that was asked me about this, that... I expressed concern about the whole issue, um, but it wouldn't be true to say that I didn't make efforts to intervene. I think I've quite comprehensively outlined the many efforts I made to intervene, but specifically on mediation through Transport Scotland, because remember Transport Scotland is the sponsored body that engages with CMAL. I did encourage mediation. I did encourage expert determination. I did encourage all sorts of interventions, including a review of was the procurement carried out properly, you know, in-house by our procurement um, uh, officials. Uh, so I did exhaust every option possible. That's, that's, but, not, but, that's not what I'm asking. Uh, I'm asking you, you about you asked, a specific okay, meeting yeah. where he says you told him, I cannot tell CMAL to get involved in mediation. I encouraged... CMAL to get involved through Transport Scotland, a discussion with them and trying to find a resolution. So much so CMAL tells you that in the evidence. They said in their evidence sessions that they, they did feel that ministers wanted mediation, but they couldn't do it. And then they outlined the reasons they couldn't do mediation, because they felt, in their words, there was no legal basis to take that forward. So in different stages, in mediation, they uh, couldn't agree the terms of reference. When that could have been agreed, couldn't get a mediator. But fundamentally, the reason expert determination or mediation couldn't have proceeded from memory was the advice was it couldn't lead to the conclusion which FML fundamentally wanted, which was more money for a fixed price contract. And CMAL's view is that cannot be done and should not be done, and no mediation will sort that. That, that is, you know, in short, why it was felt that mediation couldn't proceed in the words of... CMAL, okay. as advised to me. 